everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be about making some actual slime. And everybody knows if you have seen any of my other videos, when I make slime, I just put a little of this, a little bit of that, we get completely and hopefully I end up with the right result and get to slime. But this time, this time, I'm going to be specific and actually show you step by step how to make some actual good slime. Hopefully it's good. But we don't know for sure. I'll be making two slimes two different ways, which is going to be fun. So let's get started. So first of all, the ingredients you're going to need is a bowl, of course, and a spoon. The reason why it's stringy is because I already put some salt, uh, I almost said slime. I already put some glue in here. And the glue we are using today is one that was in my lab live last night. It's super cool, crazy art clear glue. And it's washable, I'm pretty sure. Yes. Washable clear glue. Good for me. And then, then you also need ugh, uh, food coloring optional. I've got quite a bit of food coloring. I got pink, neon, yellow, purple, and blue, which I will be choosing on that, but that'll be for another one. Then you'll need a one third of a cup of warm water. And this is optional, the, that, the, uh, this is optional, the food coloring is optional too, but this is optional. You can use contact sun solution with no water, just straight out of the bottle in there, or you can use, this is, uh, baking powder, it's baking soda. You, baking powder works, I'm pretty sure too. I haven't, I haven't actually done baking powder, but I've been using baking soda. So, you can use baking soda. And then you can also use borax. Which that's what I'll be making in my net in the next slime that I'm about to make as soon as I get done with this one. So here's we're going to make we are going to make our um uh, better. Sorry. I've got a teaspoon. This is a tablespoon. I'm gonna try to get a tea, half of a teaspoon out of this. I don't know how well it's gonna work. I'm gonna attempt I think this is the tablespoon. It's a tablespoon. I'm going to attempt to get... Uh, let me go ahead and actually look and see if there... Oh, here's one teaspoon. I need a half teaspoon. Half a teaspoon, half a teaspoon. Nope, don't have one. So then I'm just going to go half of this because this is a teaspoon. I need half. Dig in there and get some baking soda. So, I got, hopefully, a half teaspoon. I don't know how well. That's how much I got. Um, I probably may need a little less than that. But, as I said again, uh, well, it's been step by step, but still, I'm winging it. So, you're going to use a half a teaspoon. I'm using a teaspoon because I don't have a, have a teaspoon. Dang it in the washing machine. The dishwasher. <laughs> the washing machine. Don't know why I was about to say that. But it's probably in the dishwasher. Yeah. So now. I just ripped my toe in half. So it's not like. Oh, stupid chair. So, sorry about that. Uh, now we're going to pour our half teaspoon into our warm water. Or a half a cup, or a third a cup of warm water. You can use a cup, you can use half a cup. As I said, it's optional on that too. Got that. Now we're going to get a spoon. I'm going to actually get a real spoon for this. I need to dissolve this. And I have not got a spoon for that yet. I'll just get a little bit. Sorry for that noise. So I'm just going to get a fork and just stir all this up. Okay, so I think this is dissolved. And this is optional as well. You can leave this in the cup, but then you can also go without the cup. One sec. And I think, I'll, I will leave my Instagram below so I can go follow me on Instagram. 
So I think this is start up. So now we are going to actually start making this slime. So this is super easy. I said we're going to attempt to make some clear slime. I don't know. I really, I really, I kind of want to add some blue. But yes, as I said, we're going to attempt to make some clear slime. I'm a little nervous. So let's get started. First, you're going to add just a little bit of your activator into your glue. To start activating your slime or your glue, as I should say. And I will also be doing a live today, and I will be showing you how to do a. I'm not gonna tell you. I'm waiting till I post it, or it's gonna be live, so I'm. I gotta wait till y'all see it. Because it's a secret. Because we went to visit school in science today for Halloween. Whoop, loved it. Amazing. And before, I will link the uh, video name in the description. So you can go watch the video before you, um, before you actually go and try this out. Well, actually, no, I won't. I won't link it. Because... I will just show you step by step. So yeah, I'm, I'm not I'm not gonna link it because there's no need to there's no need to link it. Yeah. So whenever you try so whenever I try to make clear slime with this, it turns into white slime. So I'm gonna go ahead and add some food coloring. I'm gonna do a little bit of blue. I'm gonna do a, one baby squirt of blue and one baby squirt of purple. Oop, that was a little big drop. Oh, oh wow, this is gonna be pretty. It's gonna the purple is gonna take over, I bet. And oh yeah, see, there it goes. I always try to make a. I always try to do one and just try to add a little bit of blue and a little bit of purple. Whoop, the purple completely always takes over every time, every single time. Comment below. Comment down below if you're gonna go trick or treating tonight. And I'll give you a shout out. At the end of my next video, if you comment right now, and all you have to say is hashtag, what should you say? Say hashtag purple, purple crystal forever. Yes. You have to say purple crystal forever and you'll get a shout out. So, yes, that is what we are doing. You have to say purple crystal, purple crystal forever and you're going to get the shout out. I think it's overactivated, maybe. Probably not. I don't know if I should have started posting weekly or daily because I'm doing daily so far. I just don't post on Sundays. So I don't know if I should keep, comment down below if I should keep staying weekly or if I should keep staying daily or if I should start going weekly. I think I should start going weekly almost. I don't know why. I feel like I'm just posting so much. Like posting my clear videos in one day. And that's really, that's not daily. You know, that's like hourly. If that's a word. Alright, so we're getting somewhere. Almost there. You gotta have a little more activator. So, yeah. And you always gonna stir more than you pour. Because, you know, you may, you may think, oh, I need a lot more activator. But, you just need to stir a lot. That's one thing about slime. And that's one thing about clear, clear glue. Clear glue can do that. Especially crazy art glue. But, I think, I'm pretty sure clear glue can do it. I don't know. I just know. I just know Crazy Art does that. I don't know if it's just clear glue. Cause I've never used Elmer's clear glue. I was I was going to, but it wasn't as big as a bottle. We, we were about to buy the Elmer's, but it wasn't as big as a bottle. This thing cost twenty dollars just for that. I mean, I believe it, but I think I got the Elmer's one for a little less actually. I don't know. I don't, I don't I didn't know how much the. Uh, 
and how much it costed. Because that's what had been in my videos. Now I'm just going to add a little bit of this all around it, surround it, and our activator to get it completely activated and done. I splattered it all over me. Yeah, so we got a nice consistency right now. I want to start kneading with my hands. So, here's how I do this. We're going to remove our bowl. Sorry. Yes, we're going to remove the bowl. Set that aside. Set every all my junk aside. And start kneading. I hate when you look first making slime and it just starts getting in your fingers. Blech. And you can't get it off because then, then it just gets more on your fingers. So yeah, we're going to get our fork. Get our fork in there and just stab it right in there. So it's added some more activator. If you did not see. And now... We got ourselves some slime. Oh, actually, that's actually really fun. It just made me think. The experiment that I'm going to be doing with y'all, well, actually, I may not be able to do it. I may not have the right ingredients. I'll have, to, I'll have to look. I don't think I do have the right ingredients. I think I overactivated this. Yeah, I did. Oops. <coughs> Sorry for that noise. I think y'all will. Yeah, I, I'm not. I know y'all hear it in the live. I don't. I'm glad we've done the video on it. We're good. Now to our second. Fine. So, I'm going to go hunt for the ingredients with you guys. So, let's go. The first ingredient we will all need is water. Stump out that nasty concoction. And give ourselves a new concoction. And this concoction is super easy. You just need a little bit of warm water. I just saw that. Warm water. Y'all are good. I'm right here. Everybody knows what this is. Whoop! Borax. Sodium borax. This is, uh, yeah, this is detergent booster, by the way. Borax is detergent booster. So, if you don't know what borax actually is, it is detergent booster. I guess it just, like, boosts up your detergent. Sorry. Oh. Now, we're going to come in here. Yeah, this is the bathroom. I'm going to take a shower. We're going to get our shaving cream. I'm pretty sure... Any kind of shaving cream will work. So I keep making myself go up. I haven't shaved it, but so I keep bringing the camera down really low and getting myself double chin. Sorry, I hate that. Absolutely hate it. I hate when people sleep. You know, like um, they will people. You know. They'll have double chins in their videos. And people just comment, oh, you have a double chin like the whole entire video. How weird and stupid. Yeah. So. Score. We 
got our clean bowl. Not really. I'm trying to clean up the spoon. We got our borax. And we got our water. So, this. So, let's create our new slime. So, for this, you will also need a bowl, a spoon, uh, any kind of glue, Elmer's or Crazy Art will work. Elmer's or Crazy Art, you'll need some glue. You will need borax for this. Food coloring of your choice, which is absolutely optional. I've got four right here. Uh, shaving cream. And of course, your warm water. So this is all you this is all you will need for this super easy slime kit, I should say. It's not really a kit. But let's get started. So the first thing you will need is to pour your glue in our bowl. So we're gonna lift that up. We're gonna start. I'm just making a little bit because I don't want, I, I, I never want to waste my expensive glue, $20 glue. See that now I'm just going to, you know, stir this up. Just, just a little bit. I don't, I don't, I don't really see why I'm stirring it up. I don't, I don't see why. So now, then we're going to get our shaving cream. Pour in as much shaving cream as you want. I think there is a limit. I mean, you can't go like way overboard. Uh, I usually end up going way overboard. I haven't gone way overboard in a while. But, because we mix that slime with one of those slimes. I don't say this in the videos. So, if y'all are smart and y'all remember, comment down below what, so, what, uh, what big slime, that's a hint, what slime did I put my school green blue rainbow balls into which slime comment down below and you may have a chance to give me a shout out you will either do purple hashtag purple crystal forever or you can put hashtag blank whatever slime that is all you have to do and you will get a chance to get the shout out i will actually do two shout outs for that since i'm giving you all a chance this slime's gonna be so fluffy. I'm so fluffy, I'm gonna die. Uh, actually. Also, comment down below where that thing's from. He's so fluffy, I'm gonna die. Oh, yeah. Wait, I already got pink. Let's do two neon orange. I mean, blue. Sorry. I'm, I cannot talk. Neon yellow. Uh, neon yellow. It's actually neon green. Neon yellow. I say that a lot. I'll go, uh, like, stop a quitter. I'll, I'll go that. And actually, I would actually recommend adding your color before you add the shaving cream because then it's going to be super hard to mix all your color up with inside of your uh, concoction so far. So that's one thing I would recommend because I did not do that and I should have. But there's no need to pour this out now because it's almost already fine. And I haven't added activator. I may not, I may not even need activator for this one. But yeah, we're still gonna need quite a bit. <laughs> I think it's just the glue and the um I think it is just the glue and the shaving cream. Their consistencies reacting form together and they almost give you slime. Yes, this is actually really pretty. It's a baby green. That's a thing. It's a mint green. So, here's what we have right now. We're still mixing. Now I'm going to add one drop of blue. Hopefully get a mint green. Oh, that was not one drop. That was a little big drop. I'm going to my hand. Let me do this real quick. I'm going to put that right here. I'm not using it one bit. Not 
hand off. A little nasty. Yeah, this, I, don't, I don't know how well this is going to turn out. Hopefully it turns into an aqua color. If it mixes right together. Hopefully it's like turquoise or aqua or something. I want a pretty color. I mean, the green itself is actually very pretty. Because my favorite color is green. But also... Uh, yeah. I also love aqua. I think that's a very beautiful color. That was my favorite color. Because I just love aqua so much. Like teal... Uh, that was actually my first br brace like bracket color on my braces. It was aqua or it was teal, it was turquoise actually. Sorry, it was turquoise. That was my very first braces color on my brackets. I had to go with it because everybody was doing that. That was the trend. It was turquoise. Like they everybody did turquoise at that time. I'm like, let's get a shot. Let's see how pretty turquoise. Is. And at the moment, that was my favorite color. So then, you know, I was like, oh, I've got to do turquoise. And, yeah, I loved it. I, w I was going to do it again, but then I just kind of, you know, got, nah, let's go do another color. And I, so far, I've not done the same color twice. Actually, I have. I I've done blue three times, but it's all different shade of blue. I've all done different shades. I'm getting tired. I, and I'm trying... This video is like 21 minutes. I'm trying to make this video pretty short. So I think it's as good as we're going to get. So I think we're going to have to start adding our activator. This time I'm not going to over-activate. Alright, my other one. I'm not mole if you want me to do the uh, no bow, no, no spoon challenge. I think that would be fun. I am tired. <gasps> They're over activated up. Let's try to go with my left hand. I'm not hands get tired. Oh, yeah, we're going to have to switch back to left. I mean, right, sorry. <laughs> now that it's using my hands. That's so shaving cream. <laughs> I might add a little too much shaving cream. Probably did. I might have to pour this out. Never know. It's all fluffy. That's the last bit of activator. We'll see. It's probably not going to turn out since, like, it's mainly, um, yeah, this is our slime. I wish I could eat it some more. That's not going to happen, though. So, we're, I'm going to try to get some slime out of this. We're going to see if I can end up getting a little bit of slime. I'm going to add I'm going to make some more activator. But I'm going to go, not with borax, but with the baking soda. And if anything changes, I'm going to let this one. And I'll say I'm going to add a little more glue. See if anything happens too. Because the base of this slime right now, all it is, is, uh, what's it called? Shaving cream. So, yeah. We're going to try to, you know. Not start fresh completely, but, you know, just give it a fresh start. But it's really not actually a fresh start. It's just adding. Hopefully this video is not too long. Wait, let me crush this up. It's a big bowl.
Add a little bit of that in. And we're also going to add a little bit of this in. Just a little bit of it. Like that much. Just a little tiny bit. Whoop. Now we're going to mix this up. See what happens. I may have just totally ruined this slime. Now we got a good, you know, base. I mean, it's pretty good texture so far. It's just, you know, super light and fluffy that it's not, I don't, I don't, I just don't have the faith in it that it's going to actually turn into slime, really. I'm sorry, slime, but I don't think you're going to go anywhere where you're at right now. Sorry about that. Sorry. Uh, this video is actually turning out really long. I'm super sorry about that. Um, if it hits 30, I'm, I'm going to completely end this. Because. We're not there yet, but we're almost. 27, hit three minutes. All right, now we're good somewhere. Hi, likes. We had time, but it's almost done. Almost there. I'm gonna sit you on the table. Yeah, got me. I was pouring you on the table. No. I almost lost that slime in that lap. A little more of that. Mix it up in here. Oh, it's so fluffy, I'm gonna die. I think everybody knows what that saying's from. Okay, this thing doesn't weigh anything. <laughs> yes, it doesn't. Oh no. 29. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Because I really do like, like this slime a lot. It's beautiful. So comment down below which slime you like better. We have our pretty small, nice and stretchy. Not really. But nice and stretchy. Crystal purple. So again, if you remember... If you like this slime better, comment the, er, comment down below and put hashtag purple crystal forever and you will have a chance getting the shout out. And also, um, if you like this one better, comment down below fluffy clover. Cl fluffy clover for this one. Hashtag Fluffy Clover, and you will also get the chance to shout out. And another, one more, our last way to get the shout out is, it's so fluffy, I'm gonna die. If you get the movie right, um, you also have a chance. So there's three chances, and I'll give you a hint. If you 
name your favorite slime and get the quote right, you will have a huge chance of getting the shout out. So, yes. Thank you for watching this video. If you did, give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget to comment. You know what, because I don't say it again. And thanks for watching this video. Bye.